What it is, everybody? It's your boy, Mike Rich. Man, what's happening with y'all today? I hope everybody is having a blessed day today, man. Um, Today, I'm going to hit y'all with a early unboxing. Haven't done this in a while. It just feels good to get kicks early sometimes. And it's really, really really feel good to get sneakers that you know gonna be limited that you know it's gonna be kind of hard to get your hands on it's very good to get shoes like that man i've, I've been i ain't gonna say lucky but i've been just kind of going after what i really want instead of just getting every gr or every general release i like a lot of general releases too but like i just been trying to go after the ones i really want this year so far and it was only two that i wanted for the month of march this sneaker right here is one of them. I don't need no draw. I don't need no raffles. I didn't need none of that. All I needed to be was plugged in from my guy, Kid Square. Shout out to Kid Square, man. I appreciate you for sending these guys out to me, man. So let's, without further ado, let's go ahead and get into this unboxing. We ain't did one of these in a long time, baby. Let go, man. Without further ado, and I don't need no knife, man. Y'all know I don't need no knife because I'm I'm so I'm so excited about this sneaker right here. I'm gonna go ahead and open the box with these hands. No waiting, no waiting, man. Bow, 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 bow. And look, this is the crazy thing about this shoe right here is when you see the box, you ain't even gonna have to guess what's in the box. You ain't gonna have to guess what's in the box when you see the box. Y'all know yet? Have y'all figured it out yet? Do y'all know yet? Do you know? Do you know? Do you know? As Spike Lee so eloquently put it in the old Michael uh, Jordan commercials for the Air Jordan 3, it is some Air Jordan 3. Woo! Tyka! Tyka, Tyka, Tyka! Tinker things, man. Want to see these in hand? I know a lot of people, a lot of people said that they didn't like this shoe. A lot of people said, they weren't feeling it. And T War, you was one of them. You want to shoot now, but I remember when you said you didn't like these, man. I remember when you said you didn't like these. From the very jump, when I first seen images, I liked the idea of them doing an alternate version of something that he had in his original sketch. I'm glad he went with the Air Jordan 3 design that he went with, but I, this is like, this is like a, um, this is like a collector's piece, so to speak. This shoe right here. I love the box. It got Tinker's um, signature on it. Let's go and get to the shoes. I want to see what they look like in hand. And don't click off the video, y'all. A lot of y'all, man, I look at, I, I play very close attention to my analytics. And a lot of y'all, man, a lot of y'all, once y'all see what shoe it is, especially in unboxing videos, if you don't like it, you click off the video. Just stay through the whole video. Watch it, man. You might you might learn something. You might see something you like in the video, man. Let's go ahead and get into these things. Though. Whew, and we smell. The smell. Air Jordan 3. Tinker. Alternate things, man. Oof. Oh, these are dope. This is the third Jordan 3 I got this year. My Air Jordan 3 game was so miserable and malnourished before this year. <laughs> Bow! The Air Jordan 3 Tinker Alternate Guy. Hmm. Some good oxygen right there, man. The Air Jordan 3 Tinker Alternate. Whoa, look at that ass. Boy. I didn't want to get to that ass first, but look at that ass, boy. Oh, look at that booty. That ass, pal. These are dope. Hey, man, these are dope, man. In hand, bruh. A lot of people that hating on this shoe, man, in hand, these are flames, man. Fire, fire, whatever you want to call it, boy. They about to, they're about to burst into torch Woof, in my hand. Look at that Nike sign on that side, man. I like this shoe because it's Air Jordan 3, but it's a different take on the Air Jordan 3. And like I said, it's just some history, some blueprint action from Tinker Hatfield, the man himself. That back tab being red with a Nike L on the ass, the swoosh. To be perfectly honest with you, the swoosh, I can take it and leave it. I like it because of the way it represents. But if the swoosh was off, this shoe would be dope. With the swoosh, I still think the shoe is dope, man. Got that Tinker hat feel in the back. The signature. Like that ass is beautiful, boy. That's some beautiful ass right there, pal. Yeah. Got that Nike. Got, oh, got the leather is good. Oh, man, these are dope. 
And y'all think, man, boy, Rich, you a hype beast. He hyping this shoe up. I'm not hyping the shoe up, man. I'm just, I like it. I really dig the shoe. If y'all look back in my videos when we saw first got images of these, when we first, all the little news videos I did and I brought this shoe up, I wanted this shoe from the jump. I said, that's a dope concept. I love that red tab on the back. I love the Nike. I love the little Nike sign on this side. I love the, the black hits right here. The, man, the gray going across. And that's, what is that? That's leather too. I thought from the pictures, I thought this gray part right here was suede or new book. But it's the fact that the, the elephant print is blacked out. I thought that was dope. It's just a bruh. It's a dope shoe in my in my humble opinion, man. So uh cleansed review and on feet. Look, Nike branding everywhere. Cleansed and review and on feet is coming up. I just want to do this quick unboxing for y'all and just show y'all my first initial uh thoughts of the shoe. I didn't realize it had like an outline blueprint outline of the shoe on the inside. I don't know. I get into all that on my review, man. Red jump, man, swag, man. The thing is just stupid, bro. I'm going to do a few full detail review, close up, all that stuff. On feet, I'm going to take these things outside, in the driveway, in the street, and put these things on concrete, uh, straight to the foot game, as my man, jump man, Bossy, will say. But um, that's it on these, pretty much. I just wanted to show y'all the shoe. Uh, here's the other shoe right there. You got your hang tag. With a Tinker uh, signature and the Jumpman on it. Who these are dope. I was glad I was able to get these. They're doing a drawing on Nike. And I never want to draw it on Nike. So I didn't want to be a part of that. I didn't even want to participate in that situation. Even though I was going to do it if I wasn't able to get them from my guy Kid Square. Speaking of Kid Square, I got. I think I still got a, a code for them. They still got pairs of these. I think I still got a code for them. But I don't know if it's still working. So if it is, I'm going to put it in the description below. Or if I can get a new code, y'all just check the description below to see if I can get that in there. And also, um, Nike pushed these back. I, I almost forgot to talk about that. See, that's why you stay to the end of the video. Nike pushed these back. It's still coming out on the sneakers app and some boutiques. Well, they say tier, tier zero stores are still getting them. And tier one stores pushed them back to April 26th or April 30th. April 30th. So I have no idea what the difference between, don't get me the line, man. Do not get me the line. The difference between tier zero and tier one stores, I have no idea. But I read an article from Sneaker News that they did push these back in a lot of places to um, April 30th. So, I mean, still can try on sneakers out in a couple more sites, I guess, for these bad boys. I'm just glad I went ahead and got them in hand. Shout out to my guy, Kit Square, once again. I knew retailers, a lot of retailers were getting these early. I talked to a couple of people from some boutiques I know, and they already got their shipments of these in. So I guess um, a lot of people got them in. As you can see, Kit Square got his in. So... I was able to get me a pair of these guys, man. I appreciate y'all for watching this quick unboxing of these early Tinker alternate things, man. You feel me? So, uh, next video. Oh, man. Next video. Next unboxing is going to be better than this, in my opinion. Well, it might be better than this. I just got to see them in person. But the next shoe I got coming up is one of the ones that I was really anticipating this, this year. I'm going to do the reviewing on feet and have this one up hopefully by tomorrow if it's not raining or nothing. And I will bring y'all that other early release that I was just really looking forward to seeing them guys in hand as well. So y'all stay tuned to my channel, man. I appreciate y'all for watching. Y'all hit the thumbs up, like, subscribe, hit the notification bell so you can become a part of Rich Nation. Stand all the way up there to the moon, man. You feel me? And keep watching my video because that's what I'm here for. Gone.